Welcome to this guided mindfulness session. I'm Kurt Wolford, mindfulness consultant, trainer, and coach. I specialize in mindfulness and healthcare for both patients and providers. I am honored to be partnering with Unbound Medicine for this mindfulness series for both nurse educators and students. So let's take a look at the practices we're gonna focus on today. Two essential practices that serve as the foundation for mindfulness. The first is sigh breaths, and the second is awareness of the breath. Before we get into these two practices, let's take a look at the three key elements of mindfulness. So as you look at this cartoon, and it says it all. So you've got the human on the left, and the human is thinking about the past and the future and the to-do list and the concerns, and the dog is absolutely present, right there for what's happening. Well, as humans, we need to work on it just a bit. We need to be deliberate in our mindfulness practices so that we can have the kind of focus that comes more naturally to dogs. So these three key elements, the first, pay attention on purpose. It needs to be a deliberate practice for us. In the present moment, we want to pay attention on purpose in the present moment. And we want to suspend judgment. We want to practice non-judgmentally. So as we work with these practices in just a moment, we want to do our best, and I'll remind you, to suspend judgment. There's no right or wrong. So our first practice, side breaths. Very simple, but it stimulates the relaxation response and really helps to reduce stress and anxiety. Very simple. Children do this naturally. Dogs do it naturally. You may have noticed dogs. Sometimes they, they circle to find their spot on the ground and they lie down and then they, they sigh. So it stimulates the relaxation response without any practice, without any effort. We just need to sigh. So let's, let's practice a couple of these. So inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. And you can make a little sound on the exhales. And for the side breaths to be most effective, we want the, the duration of the exhale to be approximately twice that of the inhale. So let's count to two on the inhale and count to two on the exhale. And you may want to begin to soften your gaze or close your eyes. If it's comfortable, slow this down just a bit more. Inhale to the count of three, exhale to six. If your eyes are closed, you can begin to open them. And we'll continue to practice again. But for, before we do so, I want you to turn towards sensations in the body. I want you to know how you feel. Notice how you feel physically. And then turn towards your thinking mind. Notice what's going on up there. What are you thinking about? The past, the future, what concerns are running through your mind? And then also turn towards the emotional mind. How do you feel emotionally? What's your mood state? Relaxed, sad, anxious. How do you feel emotionally? So 
So as we continue with our side breaths, I, I will ask you on an occasion to turn towards sensations in the body, noticing how you feel physically. Turn towards the thinking mind and the emotional mind. So let's soften the gaze again and begin with the inhale through the nose and the exhale, the slower exhale through the mouth, making some sound. And experiment with these side breaths. You may find you want to slow the breath down or you may want to emphasize the exhale even more, slower, more sound. And as you continue to sigh, get curious about how you feel physically, sensations in the body, or how you feel overall. And perhaps feeling a bit more relaxed physically Sometimes this can take practice to get these uh, results. You know, we're not striving towards them, but just noticing even the slightest of shifts and how you feel physically. And then let's turn towards the thinking mind. Continue with your side breaths. and getting curious about any changes that may have occurred in the thinking mind, even if they're very subtle. So maybe less thoughts. You're still thinking, but maybe the thoughts, no um, more space between your thoughts. The thoughts don't come quite as frequently. Continue to sigh. and getting curious about changes in what you're thinking about. Perhaps less thoughts about the to-do list, or less thoughts about the future. Noticing whatever changes emerge in your thinking mind. And then turning towards the emotional mind, how you feel. Continue to sigh. Noticing shifts here that may have emerged, feeling more relaxed, more present, maybe less concerned about the future. So whatever emerges, just notice whatever changes occur from your side breaths. It's a healthy practice to just notice. Notice these shifts physically mentally and emotionally. And let's prepare to end this practice with slowly opening your eyes.
that this simple practice can be done anytime in your personal life, in your work life, sighing three times, sighing 30 times. You decide, depending on how much time you have, experiment. You'll get better and better at finding relief uh, from anxiety with these sigh breaths. Let's uh, turn towards our next practice, awareness of the breath. This is the foundational practice in mindfulness. It's very simple, but it does great things for the mind in, in terms of building the present moment's muscle, so to speak. So awareness of the breath. First, we want to turn towards uh, the breath in general. So you can soften your gaze and just turn towards your breath and notice perhaps sensations. And of course, there's a little sound as you inhale and exhale. Getting curious initially of all the sensations of breath from the nostrils, the back of the throat, the chest and the belly. And there's also a duration of breath. It takes a moment or two to inhale, exhale. Just without effort, just paying attention to the breath, getting curious, sensation, sound, duration. And as you continue to breathe, choose a sensation of breath that stands out for you. And this will become the anchor for your attention. Perhaps it's the nostrils or the air at the back of the throat, the rise and fall of the belly or the chest, some other sensation. Just begin to anchor your attention there. We're inviting our attention to rest, to anchor on this chosen sensation of breath without effort. And of course the mind is going to wander. It's going to find the past, the future. It's going to run its concerns. That's what the mind does. So we don't resist the wandering mind. We don't judge it. We just notice when the mind is wandered and we return our attention to chosen sensation of breath again and again, as often as is needed. So I'll stop talking for a minute or two and just experiment with this simple practice. So without effort, directing attention to sensation of breath. On the inhale, sensation of breath on the exhale. And as soon as you notice your attention has wandered, no judgment, no resistance to the wandering mind. Just notice, like, ah, oh, my attention has wandered, and I'm going to practice a kind of firm return. Bring my attention back to sensation of breath again. So continue on your own. I'll be silent for the next minute.
Continue to practice anchoring attention on sensation of breath, noticing when the mind has wandered. Sometimes we get caught in the stream of thinking. You can be in thoughts for a while, and then just bring your attention back to sensation of breath again. Let's prepare to end this practice with three side breaths. And open your eyes if they're closed. So awareness of breath can be practiced spontaneously throughout the day. You might do a 30 second version of this. It can also be done more formally in a seated meditation or lying in your bed at night before you drift off to sleep. Just practice. Practice for three minutes. Practice for 30 minutes. Just pay attention to the breath and notice when the mind wanders. Build this present moment orientation within you. Create that present moment muscle. So thank you for joining me for this mindfulness session. For more information about Unbound Medicine resources and initiatives, email us at wellness at unboundmedicine.com.